Hello, I'm Cole Powell, award-winning singer-songwriter from Random Mind Records. If you enjoy what you hear, be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and click the bell for notifications. Also, if you'd like the ability to help us choose what content to react to on the channel, as well as early access to reaction videos, consider supporting us on Patreon for $1 a month. The link's in the description. We also have $2 and $3 tiers that would give you access to exclusive content such as full-length album reactions, as well as full-length music-related television episode reactions. All right, now I'll shut up and get to the music. Yeah. Bluegrass. My baby don't mess around because he loves me so, and this I know for sure. But does she really want to can't stand to see me walk out the door? Mm. Yeah. Don't try to fight the feeling because the thought alone is killing me right now. Mm. And the vocals. it right there yeah this is fantastic i wasn't familiar with the original version of this from outcast so i actually just went listen to it right before <laughs> i went to film this i actually thought about doing a reaction to it but because i knew going in that that wasn't my genre i decided not to because it was probably a high chance i wasn't gonna like it and I try to minimize reacting to stuff that I'm not going to like. And I'm just going to have to sit here going, yeah, not my cup of tea. It's happened before, but, you know, we don't, this isn't a channel that's about hating on songs or about just sitting here and saying, yeah, I appreciate the talent, but it's not, not my thing. But I actually didn't end up hating the original version of this. It was almost a early Beatles quality to it, which is what they kind of hammered. <laughs> On on the official video because that's what I watched the official video version. It was like that the the group, which it was actually just one member of the guys, Andre, that was playing each part of the band, and they were doing like they were an Ed Sullivan show act. So I thought I thought that was that was pretty cool. But again, ultimately, it wasn't my cup of tea. Probably would never listen to the song again. For them to have taken that, or for Avi to have taken that and done this this folk bluegrass type thing and i can also hear this being easily adapted their version being easily adapted to the ukulele it's got that kind of easy vibe the harmonies are great here i don't know the rest of the group that's played with him here i checked out the entire avriel and sequoia's ep i think it was an ep and not a full album if i'm not mistaken so this is a non-EP single. I want to check this out. I put it on the poll at one on on the first poll. Phenomenal job. The harmony sounds great. Avi, again, his range, I've said this before on videos, is just absolutely incredible. When he, to me, it was unexpected for him to drop as low as he did there in that one spot. Just, I, I love this. This is right up my alley. Regular views of the channel. You know how much I love country folk bluegrass range yeah absolutely fantastic let's get back to it you think you got it oh you think you got it but got it just don't get it when there's nothing at all oh, 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 oh. we get together oh we get together it's always better when there's feelings involved. Oh, 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 oh. If what they 
say is nothing is forever than what makes love the exception. Yeah. Great bluegrass style oh, why, harmonies why, there. Why, oh, why, oh, why, oh, we so in the night when we know we're not oh, happy here. Yeah. Hey. Again, to take the original and adapt it into this, absolutely brilliant. Okay. Yeah. Got the actual shaker going there in the ice. Shake it like a Polaroid. Shake it like a Polaroid. Great three part harmony here. Shake it like a Polaroid. 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 Hey. That was great. What a brilliant way to adapt that section of the song and then come back into it like this. Yeah. yeah. They're good too, the back of vocalists. Yeah, that was phenomenal. Absolutely slayed it. Again, going in, I was just curious how they're going to be able to do this because, I ju again, just listened for the first time the original version of this, and I was like, you know, this is going to be this is going to be interesting to see how they adapt this because I do, or I say they, Avi, I know is this is his project. He is Avi Dillon Scorius, but how he was going to adapt this because it's so different the original so different from his sound and he did not disappoint this was just excellent all the way around i don't know who the other musicians is are somebody may have said this in a comment at some point in the past but it's been a long time so if you would drop the names of the musicians that were performing with him because they were also phenomenal great singers as well the arrangement on this was great. This is the second, I believe only the second cover I've heard Avi do solo. The other one being Lean On Me, which was actually the first Avi solo I checked out. That was another one where he took a genre that didn't really match the whole folk acoustic vibe, and he adapted it and was absolutely incredible. So yeah, this is great, and I'm definitely going to be checking out more Avi. I want to finish checking out all of his EPs. I don't think I've gotten to all of them yet, and any of the singles like this, the non-EP, non-album singles. So y'all stick around. We'll definitely be checking out some more Avi soon. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, consider supporting us on Patreon. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and we'll see you soon.